a bit more regular with your Chinese. I was ashamed about speaking English because I cannot speak in English like a native speaker. I noticed that is not good for me. I should have spoken English more without shyness, uh, which is the easiest way to improve my English. I used to be very shy. I couldn't even talk to the person with eye contact. I didn't like my personality like, which is the shy. I think that American culture made me change my personality and overcome my shyness. I don't know if I am still shy or not, but I can talk to the people with eye contact now. I have learned a lot of things about shyness during the past year and after research for this speech. So today I would like to teach you about the problem of the shyness, the cause of shyness, and persuade you to overcome shyness. First, I'll start with the problem of shyness. Many shy people have experienced isolation from society and the emotional problem. According to the article BBC News, shy people tend not to try talking to new people. They don't like meeting new people. So when they talk, when they talk to the new people, they feel nervous. The statistic in the article um, understand and overcome overcoming shyness shows many people have experienced shyness, which is about 50% of people experience shyness in their life, and 80% have felt shyness in their in their part of life, and also doctorate research at the University of Tulsa in Oklahoma. Uh, when shy people get a job, they have a trouble because they don't have a communi communication skill. Recently, like many companies require the communication skill, so it is hard for shy, shy people to get a job. So next, I'll talk about the cause of shyness. Shyness is caused by culture, technology, and uh, environment. First, uh, again, according to the article, uh, understanding, understanding and overcoming shyness. Uh, different cultures have a different definition of what is normal, interpersonality, and society. In Japanese culture, shyness shows cuteness or politeness, especially for women. Elizabeth Borges, a professor at the University of Copenhagen said, in Japanese culture and Chinese culture, people use the message which include communicative cues such as body language and use of silence. They are categorized as a high text culture. Second, for the technology developed, there are many ways to contact with people without meeting, such as Facebook and Skype. These are very helpful, but however, like people depend on te this technology too much, which causes the lack of communication People should talk with meeting. Third, in the childhood, your parents might tell you not telling or talking to the stranger. You are not used to talking to new people. So in this case, uh, this case can be the habit of being shy. There are some 
causes of shyness. But how do you overcome shyness? These are uh, three optional treatments to overcome shyness. The first treatment to overcome shyness is to find the right person to talk. According to the BBC News, shy people feel it hard to talk to new people. So they need to practice talking to the people many times. Second, uh, you should recognize the your behavior of avoidance and self-defending. The when shyness happens, because if you know your pattern of shyness, you can deal with a problem of shyness. Another optional treatment is that you should not try to be perfect. Perfect nitisis tend to be uh, afraid to make a mistake. You need to be more optimistic. Um, as, we, as we have seen, many people experience shyness because culture and technology and uh, environment can make you shy. Shyness causes a lack of communication. The isolation from the isolation from society and lack of confidence. If you are shy, you should overcome it. And to overcome shyness, there are three ways talking to people and understanding your act with the pattern of the shyness and trying to be optimistic. When you challenge anything with the shyness, you can perform better in the social situations. So don't be shy.